When I was a little girl, I would say to my Aunt Betty, Betty, tell me, what was life like in the old country? Come on, what was it like in Russia? What did you eat? What did you do? Did you go to school? And Betty would say to me, Doll, I don't remember nothing about life in the old country. I'm an American now. And I would be deeply disappointed. So I kept asking the way kids do, and Betty, bless her heart, kept responding over and over and over again, Doll, I don't remember nothing. And when I was 12 years old, it occurred to me that I should change the question. All right, Betty, I said. You say you don't remember anything about life in the old country, but do you remember any stories anyone told you? And Betty said, doll, I told you. Here, have some chicken soup with matzo balls. <laughs> and then she paused. You know, she said, my grandma, she told me that if ever you're in trouble, big trouble, not like you got a bad grade at school, but big trouble, like the Cossacks are coming to get you. <laughs> you go into the woods, and you wander in the woods until you don't know where you are anymore. And then you wait and you listen until you hear this strange scratching sound, and then you go towards that sound, and there it is, the rest of this house. You see, it's a house on chicken legs, she said to me. And chickens are always restless, so the house, it just wanders around. And you say to the house, hey, look at me. And if you're lucky, the house will turn around and settle itself down, wiggling its little chicken butt. <laughs> and then this old lady will come out with a big nose and a big chin and gray hair. And me, at 12 years old, I looked at Aunt Betty and thought, Betty, it's you. <laughs> and then the old lady, she will either help you or she will eat you. And either way, your problem's taken care of. <laughs> well, I think I was 16 or so when I found the Baba Yaga stories. And I read them knowing that this was who my Aunt Betty was talking about. And there was something to this that pulled at me like a, a rope wrapped around me, just tugging me into the woods. It wasn't long after that I found myself in the woods looking for Baba Yaga. And what I found there, to find out. <laughs> 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 <laughs>